Welcome to our podcast where we'll be talking about one of the most common diseases in the world, diabetes. So, what is diabetes? Well, simply put, it's a chronic disease that affects the way your body processes blood sugar, also known as glucose. Normally, when you eat food, your body breaks down the carbohydrates into glucose, which is then transported into your cells with the help of a hormone called insulin. However, in people with diabetes, their body either doesn't produce enough insulin or it can't use the insulin it produces effectively. As a result, glucose builds up in their bloodstream, leading to high blood sugar levels, which can cause a variety of health problems over time. There are two main types of diabetes, type 1 and type 2. Type 1 diabetes is an autoimmune disease where the body attacks and destroys the cells in the pancreas that produce insulin. This means that people with type 1 diabetes need to take insulin injections or use an insulin pump to manage their blood sugar levels. On the other hand, type 2 diabetes is a metabolic disorder where the body becomes resistant to insulin and the pancreas can't produce enough insulin to keep up with the body's demands. Type 2 diabetes is often linked to lifestyle factors such as obesity, inactivity and poor diet choices. Now, you might be wondering what the symptoms of diabetes are. Well, some of the most common symptoms include frequent urination, increased thirst, blurry vision, fatigue and slow wound healing. If left untreated, diabetes can cause serious complications such as nerve damage, kidney disease and cardiovascular disease. That's why it's important to get a proper diagnosis and start managing your blood sugar levels as soon as possible. So, how can you manage diabetes? Well, there are several lifestyle changes you can make such as eating a healthy diet, exercising regularly and maintaining a healthy weight. The treatment for diabetes can vary depending on the type and severity of the condition. But generally speaking, it involves a combination of diet, exercise and medication. Now, as you know, diabetes is a chronic condition that requires ongoing management. This means that people with diabetes need to be proactive about their health and work closely with their doctor to develop an effective treatment plan. For people with type 1 diabetes, daily insulin is necessary to manage their blood sugar levels. This can be done either through injections or via an insulin pump. With proper management, people with type 1 diabetes can lead healthy, fulfilling lives. On the other hand, people with type 2 diabetes may be able to manage their condition through lifestyle modifications such as maintaining a healthy diet, exercising regularly and maintaining a healthy weight. In some cases, oral medications or insulin injections may be necessary to help manage blood sugar levels. It's important to note that every individual's diabetes treatment plan will be unique to their specific needs. That's why it's important to work closely with your doctor and diabetes care team to develop a personalized plan that works for you. In conclusion, managing diabetes requires ongoing effort and dedication, but it is possible. It's important to understand the basics of diabetes so that you can make informed decisions about your health. Remember, early diagnosis and management of diabetes can help prevent serious complications and improve your quality of life. By making lifestyle changes and working with your healthcare team, you can effectively manage your diabetes and enjoy a healthy, fulfilling life. Thanks for listening and we hope you found this podcast informative. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment in the comment section. If you found this podcast helpful, don't forget to like and share it with your friends and family. And make sure to subscribe to our channel for more informative content like this. Thank you for watching. See you next time.